What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we actually got a massive new leak and I originally was going to make some season 4 content videos but this is way more important. It looks like the Black Ops 6 pre-order bonus rewards, the operator skins, even the vault edition has been officially leaked. We got a first look photo at all that good stuff here in this video. So if you find the video helpful or informative, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on any Call of Duty news or updates. But let's go ahead and let's jump into it. Earthbound, a leaker, actually went into the brand new season 4 update files and extracted some new information in regards to black ops 6 we know that this upcoming june 9th is the full xbox game showcasing within that showcasing they're going to give us a full reveal of call of duty and as soon as that ends up happening the game itself will get an update and it'll be like a small playlist update then there will be an extra tab that says black ops 6 pre-order giving you the opportunity to go ahead and purchase the game for whatever platform you're currently playing on he went ahead and showcased what the pre-ordering is going to look like so these are the different logos that they have the first one is going to be the call of duty black ops 6 standard edition this will be the version that will cost you 69.99 usd there's usually nothing special about this one it's just a regular copy of black ops without the vault edition without any other stuff you just purchase this one and you end up getting the game the next one after this one is the cross-gen edition from my understanding mw3 didn't have one it was modern warfare 2 that had one and it was pretty much the same exact price 69.99 usd but what made it a cross-gen is the fact that you can use it on ps4 as well as on ps5 within the same account it's the same exact case here because apparently black ops 6 is going to be releasing for older gens as well meaning that playstation 4 and xbox older gens will have access to black ops 6 but then it's also going to be cross-gen meaning that if you get this one you'll be able to play it on both platforms no problem and then the last photo that they provided right here of the actual editions is the vault edition this is the one that costs you 99.99 usd it's going to bring in the game along with that there's usually a couple of bundles black cell over the last couple years black cell has has been added as a part of the vault edition they don't confirm if the vault edition in this case is going to have black cell and if that's going to be returning to black ops 6 i know a lot of you guys are not a fan of black cell so maybe that is a good thing but in terms of the content and the rewards and the things that you will be able to get from that we actually have photos of that so shout out to earthbound once again the first photo that we have here is going to be of the regular pre-order bonus that you get if you pre-order the game this is what you are going to be able to unlock three different operator skins and these are going to be for Frank Woods. So here's what it looks like. This is the first default regular skin for Frank Woods available. It doesn't matter which version of Black Ops 6 you end up pre-ordering. As long as you end up clicking that pre-order button, you will actually end up getting this as a reward and he will be playable in Modern Warfare 3. So this is not going to be a Black Ops 6 operator. This is the first style. The second one is like an animated version of him with those, you know, the number sequences that we get from the Black Ops series his eyes are now glowing this is now a animated version of that same operator skin so now it looks a little bit crazier once again will be available as an extra additional style for that same operator skin and then the third one which now they showcase a photo of all three is there is a zombie version of Frank Woods and this is also going to be a playable operator as well so this is what the pre-order bonus is looking like as of right now and honestly it looks crazy they did change him up a little bit slightly for example his eye color looks a little bit different the fact is he looks young here and he looks as a playable operator maybe that could indicate that he will be playable in black ops 6 and he won't be in a wheelchair i'm not sure how that will end up going on but what are your thoughts and opinions on this this is the first photo that we have in regards to the pre-order bonus now surprisingly on top of that there is a vault edition at first he ended up showcasing this photo which was a little bit blurry but then it actually showed some better quality and this is what it looks like so you have the vault edition if you end up spending 99 99 usd among some of the content that you get with black ops 6 will be this brand new bundle that they showcase right here and these are not going to be playable operators in modern warfare 3 this means that these are going to be skins that will be saved for you for when black ops 6 arrives and then you will be able to use these operator skins then and from the photos you can already tell who some of these characters are you see brutus you also see klaus and honestly some of these operator skins look pretty sick so imagine this is what black ops 6 will look like day one they have that milsim style there's obviously that glowing zombie effect that they usually have but at the same time you still got that milsim style that many of you guys wanted to see the skins don't look too outlandish obviously there's like glowing lights the mask and all that good stuff but they got to try and make the skin look as nice as possible if they're going to include it in the vault edition but what are your thoughts and opinions this is just giving us a first look at what the black ops operator skins are going to end up looking like towards the future so we're not seeing any like furries or animal skins or anything like that that could potentially 
actually happen. But at the moment, this is what the game is looking like. Does this have you guys hype? But on top of this, we actually have another photo. And this one comes in from Bob. He showcases Frank Woods in game. So this is just further proof that Frank Woods will be a playable operator here in Modern Warfare 3. And you can see him in game. And this is what he will look like. I'm definitely excited for that. One of the biggest questions that I've seen a lot of you guys comment, and I'm also wondering myself, is will this Frank Woods operator skin carry forward into Black Ops 6? I know a lot of you guys have operator skins, bundles, camos that you've been asking about. Those, unfortunately, it doesn't seem like they will carry over into the game, but things that come in exclusively for Black Ops 6, for example, the Frank Woods operator skin, I feel like would make a little bit more sense for those to carry on over. Now, for those of you guys who plan on getting the Xbox Game Pass and not paying for Black Ops 6, and from my understanding, the pre-order rewards will be still granted to you. That will be something that gets fully answered in the Xbox gameplay showcasing. I know the Vault Edition probably will not end up including that because you're just going to get the standard version, meaning that you're probably going to have to pay an extra fee and pay the $30. Usually they sell it as like an additional DLC of $30 if you want to end up upgrading to Vault Edition if you already have Black Ops. So that's something that you can end up potentially doing if you do want the Vault Edition, pay for the Xbox Game Pass and then the one-time $30 to end up getting the Vault. Anyways, in terms of other leaks that we have, Semtex posted, he said, the Black Ops 6 reveal event in Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone will consist of having a few different player completed challenges with exclusive rewards. You have the truth lies, gain the exclusive execution, evidence board and discovered intel to uncovering the mole so apparently there will be an in-game event that will go live that will pretty much give you some different types of rewards or i guess reveal black ops 6 even more or maybe play some sort of animation but i believe that's going to be showcased on the xbox game showcasing so i'm not entirely sure maybe this will just be an event that will go on towards or around the same exact time one thing else that he actually ended up coding is he said they specifically left out everything but the pre-order images for black ops 6 so it's looking like maybe call of duty wanted these to purposely get leaked so it could just build more marketing hype for black ops 6 overall so that's actually something that's pretty sick but what are your thoughts and opinions based on some of this information right now that you're seeing in regards to this new call of duty title remember this is just one of many leaks that are going to be coming in with this brand new season 4 update we haven't even dived into the new content the new upcoming operator skins the different camo rewards with the new warzone reward system them, the different features that they added into the game with today's update so there's a lot of news that we're going to go over and talk about over these next couple days and as you get more information i'm going to keep continuing and covering these for you guys you may end up getting a couple more photos for black ops 6 but from my understanding is they're probably going to wait up until next week which is like a week and a half from now up until the actual reveal for black ops 6 and then after that everything will end up getting updated in game my guess is there may be an update in that time frame a little bit before the xbox game showcasing where maybe they add the rest of the stuff into the files more details of this event and remember we're still only like an hour into this brand new season 4 update so there's still a lot to be discovered anyways just remember there's going to be a lot more that's going to be coming out so i'll keep you guys updated as we get more news and information if you're not sub definitely hit that sub button turn the notifications on but that's all that i got for you guys here in today's video if you found it helpful don't forget to hit that like button. it's been your boy Trizzo, and hopefully i'll be seeing you guys back on the channel again peace